So, would you like to change your domain using GoDaddy? I'm going to show you how to get started in a very easy, easy way. There's two things you need to get started with. The very first thing you want to go is to go into your actual website. You want to change, of course, your domain. So, look into your GoDaddy account. Start by logging into your GoDaddy account using your credentials. Once you're logged in, what you want to do is to go directly into the account dashboard. Once you're here into the account dashboard, we want to access the domain settings. In this case, I'm going to go for my domains. For any reason, actually, this appears inside uh, into Spanish because I'm currently into Mexico City, but you have to work the process exactly the same. All right, so directly in here, what you want to do is to, within the domain settings, look for an option to edit domain details. This might be the label differently depending on GoDaddy and the face, but typically involves clicking on the manage DNS or edit the domain. So in this case, here is my workspace. Here is my domain. So I click in it. And it's going to be taking me here into my domain section. So I go once again into my domains. And you can see that we are in the configuration of this domain. So now what I wanted to do is to change this domain name. You want to locate a field where you can enter the new domain name. Type this on your domain name that you wanted to change to. Keep in mind that the new domain name must be available and not already registered by someone else. If I go directly into my domain configuration, I want to go here and to delete this domain. And why is that? Because what I wanted to do is to delete this domain in order to create a new one. So sometimes you might be receiving a refund, sometimes you might receive a refund after you make the purchases, and of course, depending on how much time you have used this domain link. So once you are no longer available to use this domain, then what you can do is to go directly into domains so you can buy a new domain into the upper side. So I went for domain and I look out for a new domain. So this is the part what you wanted to confirm the chases. So go into my domains, go into look out for a new domain and check out for the new domain you want to purchase. Once you find a domain you want to purchase, go here inside this basket. And of course, once you have your new domain, let's go directly into my products. Directly into my product, what you want to do is now to change all these new sections of this DNS section of the domain. And of course, add those directly inside your new website. In my case, it will be added into my custom domains of the Google. So in the administrator of the DNS section, I just go directly into the DNS and I add my new C name. Usually it's going to be a C name, a TXT file or an A name, depending on what is the actual uh, website builder that you chose. After you make the configuration, then your actual store has now been changed from one domain into the other one. And that how guys is you change your actual domain from GoDaddy. You needed to give up your current domain and then purchase the other domain so you can now move on with the actual DNS managed request. And there you have it. With that being said, you can now reach it at the very end of the video. But don't forget to like and subscribe for the channel if you wanted to see more amazing tools with GoDaddy, domain listing, website building, and so much more directly into TechPress. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully, with all that being said, we can see you to a brand new section of TechPress. See you next time.